My name is Rodney Siboy. I'm from the organization called Kukula, this based in Bushbag region, Pumalanga. I'm the chief executive officer of the organization. We wanted to, to preserve, to protect the, our knowledge, our cultural practices, as we are doing on a day-to-day -day basis. We wanted to see the sustainable use of our natural resources protected. That's why we started this organization. And one other thing is to make sure that our knowledge is not taken away. And because we have got the wealth of knowledge. I conducted research here in South Africa on intellectual property rights and traditional medicine and traditional healing in Bushbuck Ridge, where I spent six months with the healers. Yeah, the type of knowledge that we are having is the, is the indigenous knowledge. I mean, the traditional one. It's the knowledge that we inherit from our forefathers. So that was, we want to keep it for the new generation. It's knowledge about treatment of element of diseases. And they were using the species, the plants. In our organization, we have got what we call the BCP. It's a biocultural protocol. So that serves as a tool, as a guideline to, for us. So that everyone who's coming to have access of our knowledge, we must follow the protocol, even the researchers. So it's something that is guiding us. And it also helps us as a healers not to do the over-harvesting. We must know how to harvest the, the medicinal plants for sustainable use. So they had an agreement with a local cosmetic company to set up a, like an um, exchange of plant material, which they did. And within this process, they set up a TK Commons in order to be able to protect their own knowledge within their own community. And this TK common system differentiates from the old system of knowledge sharing. The old system is based on the idea that knowledge would be transferred within um, healers' schools or impandes from a teacher to an apprentice. Now this, the TK commons, the new idea of sharing and pooling knowledge is is based on a more democratic kind of system. The old system is kind of hierarchical mm -hmm. as a transfer system. Now this TK Commons is, has more the idea of sharing knowledge within all kinds of different healers. Doesn't matter which kind of healing schools they're from or where they come from, which ethnic group. Before we worked individually, but now we decided to come together as one. When we started, we were about 80 healers that come together. We said, no, let us bring the knowledge together so that the knowledge must not go away. In that way, we are trying to, to, to document our, 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 our knowledge so that even if there are some potential investors or the companies that like to develop business with us, and then they can come to us and then we can share the knowledge with, with them. <laughs>